Demand it! Demand it! Go there! Go there! More! 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 Do not give up to my lord! Tom Platts began his bodybuilding journey at a young age. He was born on June 26, 1955, in Fort Sill, Oklahoma, USA. As a child, he was heavily influenced by his father, who was a weightlifting enthusiast. Tom Platz's father was a weightlifting enthusiast, which likely influenced Tom's early exposure to weight training and physical fitness. Tom Platz emphasized the importance of the mind-muscle connection during his workouts. He believed that truly feeling the muscle working during each repetition was crucial for maximizing growth and development. When I was a young man, I said, I will not be a victim to my genetics. I don't care. I don't care. I don't have a small waist. Hell with it. My genetics will be a victim to me. That was my, my plan. God gave me this mentality. I don't know why it gets me in trouble lots of times too. It does, okay? But God gave me the leg thing. I, I, I gotta tell you, most of those squats I did, I wasn't doing it. It wasn't me. It was God finishing the last 10 reps, okay? I had most success training calves twice a week. I did normal calf raises, you know, standing calf raises and seated calf raises. But one thing I did on the standing calf raise on certain days and on the seated calf raise, at the end of my workout, I would put slowly and progressively as many plates as possible. And my goal was to just hold the weight, not up high, not real low, but in the middle, into where I could hold it, I could barely hold it. I'd have some of the big guys, the monster guys in the gym push on it for me, barely, and I'd, they'd watch me and stay close to me. And as soon as I felt that it was getting too much, and I could, my tendons and ligaments couldn't handle the tension, I would say, take it now, and they took it. So I really believe that the static rep, the partial static rep, proved to be unbelievable uh, it was magic for my calves.